guys, so this year I wanted to do my what I got for Christmas video because unlike other years I got a lot of horsey stuff. So I think I've done this video about two or three times before, um, I, didn't, I know I didn't do it last year. Um, and I always start by saying I'm not buying or anything. Um, you guys always ask me what I got for Christmas so I thought I would show you, especially because a lot of it is horsey. So I've just chosen the things I think you guys will be interested in. Um, so I got a lot of other stuff besides this, um, but yeah, so I'll start with like the little things that my mum got me that were um, horsey. So the first thing she got me was from Robin Road Knight Equestrian and it is this G. So it has this pattern of different horses, some are show jumping, some I think are doing dressage, um, and it's blue with sort of a off-white background and it's just so pretty. I did expect it to be bigger, I'm not going to lie, it looks a lot bigger on the website. Um, but I thought it was really nice, so I'm going to pop this either on the wall or sort of on my desk or somewhere. So then she got me a few items for my uni, so she got me this really cute little notebook um, that's got sort of like bead details and it's all sort of sewn um, and that's got a little squirrel on because I love anything with animals. Um, and then she got me a one a day page diary which is really sweet. It's got little zebras with little hats and things on. So there are all the little items that my mum got me. I'll show you all the clothing she got me later. Um, but then Greg got me quite a few things. So he got me some uh, new batteries and a new charger for my DSLR. Because um, I'm always complaining that I never have um, enough batteries and that my camera's going to run out and things like that. So bless him, he got me those. In terms of cameras, he's also buying me the G7 Mark II, which is like the vlogging camera of all vlogging cameras. And I'm so excited, but we're just waiting for that one to come. Um, but yeah, I'm so happy that he's getting me that. It's just like amazing. Um, and he also got me this video microphone um, for the camera. So it's a little compact on the microphone. I'm actually using it now. Um, and it also has the little um, fluffy thing that sort of covers it up so that when I'm videoing outside and things like that it's not going to be really windy for you guys um, and hopefully the audio is clearer so there's going to be a lot more sort of better quality videos um, I'm sort of really trying to focus on that for you. So the next things Greg got me I got early because he got me them at Olympia so he got me this Lemire top and it's their base layer and it's the new collection I think it's my Lemire and um, yeah, so I got this one because I don't have anything purple. I'm not a big purple fan, but I really like this plum sort of purple colour with the grey detailing. So it looks like this. Um, it's really, really nice. I've already been wearing it and I love it. I actually think this is my favourite base layer and I really like base layers at the minute. Um, but I really love the colour. So I got the purple plum coloured saddle pad. Um, it's the general purpose one. Um, I just thought it'd be really nice to have a nice matching set. I think this is like my second Lemure um, saddle pad. Lucy's got a um, white dressage square um, and I really do like these. I just thought it was very nice. So yeah, I got that to match. So then moving on to sort of the other horsey um, items that my mum got me. She got me some new riding socks. So every year I get her a pair of riding socks and she gets me some um, I got her the Caldean ones I believe and mum got me the Toggy ones so they're brown, red and white um, so these ones have like horse on, these ones have the horse shoes on and then these ones are spotty with the horse on the top so I thought these are really nice, I really like Toggy socks, they're very warm um, definitely what I need in winter although I wear riding socks all year round so then um, some more sort of riding things she got me, she got me a couple of Ariat things because I love Ariat and I don't really have that much Ariat stuff, uh, although it's rather expensive. So she got me this Ariat base layer. I actually have the exact same one, but in sort of like a light baby blue. Um, so she got me this one in the pink, and again, it's got the grey to go with it. And I just thought it was really nice, because I already know that I love my blue one, and I don't actually own any pink things, and it's quite a nice bright pink. It'll be better sort of in spring, um, I think. But it does, it is the heat series. So it's the beat the heat, stay cool and dry. So this is definitely more for the so summer, but I just thought I'd get it now. So we went um, shopping to choose all these things. Um, 
And the next thing that I chose is the opposite. It's for the cold series from Ariat. Um, so this is to keep me warm during winter. And it's this one. So it's their um, quarter zip top. It's in their traditional navy and red colours. It's so nice. Um, I really like it on. And it has Ariat down the side, on down the arm. And it has the little logo on the front as well. And this is really thick. It's really nice and warm. Um, I've not worn it like around the staves or anything yet but I have tried it on and it was really warm and nice so I'm really excited to wear that. So next I wanted some um, either some jodhpurs or some riding leggings and I wanted to also try some things that I hadn't tried before. So these are the Noble Outfitters um, riding tights so I don't know which, I don't know if it tells you what colour these ones are. So these are just the balance riding tight and they're sort of in a charcoal grey. They're really nice. Um, and they're not like other riding leggings, they sort of have a lot more to them, um, although still so comfy. I actually think these might be the comfiest things I've ever tried on. Um, so they're grey, they have the inner leg um, with the suede, which is nice for grip. They also have these stretchy bottoms, um, so it's nice because it, it's a bit different, it's not all one colour like most leggings. They also have a really good pocket, so most leggings have just a sliding pocket whereas these have a concealed one so it means that you can put your phone in and sort of leave it in there I know most leggings I wouldn't keep my phone in while I'm riding or something like that or doing yard duties because I just don't trust it to not fall out whereas with these with it being the concealed pocket I think your phone's sort of s snug and safe in there so no black fitters I'm obsessed with at the minute and I just really do love these very excited to wear them to ride and things like that so the last horsey thing my mum got me, she got me a few other bits and bobs but they weren't really horse animal related so I got pyjamas and like a new dressing gown and slippers and things like that. Um, so she got me this gilet, it's the HB Polo Snake Skin Effect gilet. Um, when we saw this it was in black and I wasn't 100% sure so then mum ordered me the navy online because I thought it's sort of different, a lot of things I own are black and I really like the navy. Um, it's got the hood and then it says HB Polo down the back which I really like and it's one of these that I always think gilets you either look really good in them or you, they just don't fit you at all and this one fitted me really really well so I was very excited for that um, but yeah so I really do love so that. So one of my major presents that I got this year was from my nan and granddad um, so they got me a solo shot tripod which I hadn't heard of until I started researching it but basically it's a tripod that you sort of stick somewhere um, and then you wear this little armband and it tracks you so I can pop that in the middle of the arena I can pop it at the side and it will just track me as I go around which means it's great for me because it makes my life so much easier because it means I don't have to like nag someone to come and stand in the arena um, and take photos and film for me because my um, tripod will just follow me so my camera is already auto focused so that means I can get a lot more videos done for you guys because I've not got to then rely on someone being there when I'm riding so that was really good I was really thankful for that they also got me a few other bits like some perfumes some makeup and clothes and stuff like that um, and then my sister did a really cute thing that I wanted to show you so my sister bless her went a bit crazy um, and got me this entire box of stuff so it's not horsey related but I just thought it was really sweet so in here she put a load of things so she put things like popcorn and chocolate and lots of sweets and even little um, sort of decorations and drinks so she got me some book spheres and things like that and it's completely like <laughs> full of stuff um, so yeah, so my sister got me that and I just thought it was really lovely. So that is pretty much everything I got for Christmas. I got a few gift sets. Um, I got a lot of Jules stuff this year as well. Um, all sort of your normal stuff you get on Christmas and lots of little um, chocolates and things like that. So I was so grateful and had such a good Christmas. Obviously it's not um, about the presents but it was really nice to receive my items. So I hope you guys have had a great Christmas. Let me know in the comments below what you got. And if you did get one of my hoodies for Christmas, because I know a lot of them were bought for Christmas presents, don't forget to um, send me your photos on Instagram, because I'd love to see you in them. 
So yeah, that is everything. I hope you guys have liked this video and I will see you guys very soon.